when days are getting kind of bad, sometimes, honestly, I think about Harriet Tubman a lot. It kind of helps me keep in perspective. Uh, when you feel like you're just having a bad day, and I'm thinking, you know, you know she, she kept on, she persevered, and she was doing that at risk of her own life. And that's a, a great example for me of a strong, relentless uh, woman who is driven by what she clearly sees as the needs that are still there without worrying about the risk to herself or minimizing the risk to herself. And that, that's a great role model, too. I like when we get a recognizable piece of paper, either from immigration or from a superior court or from the immigration court itself. And we're getting a piece of paper that says, yes. Like, yes, the immigration court is going to terminate your deportation case. Or yes, immigration, the other branch of immigration has just approved your petition something like that, or yes, the superior court says that they are going to give you the special order that you need so that you can file your petition with immigration. That, that's, it's, it's just great. It's great because it, it's not just that, oh yes, well, you know, we got what we wanted, but having heard the deeper stories that underlie that, that means a lot of times, many, many times, that means yes, through a collaborative effort, People are helping to keep a child alive, literally alive. People are helping to protect a woman against being beaten to a pulp or drowned in a, t a tub of laundry water from an abusive boyfriend or an abusive spouse. Or yes, there's a young woman who's being, who is now going to have some protection so that she won't have to return to El Salvador and be kidnapped, beaten, raped, tortured, and murdered because she didn't want to become the girlfriend of a gang member.